I hope everyone's well and I hope everyone's had a lovely Easter. Um, I have, but I've been celebrating a little bit later and having fun with family and doing things like that. So I thought I'd just do a really quick video of sort of unboxing some of the Easter eggs that I've got. Um, there's quite a lot, but I will say we are all actually sharing and um, we all bake. So also we'll be using some of the chocolate to bake things with as well. So don't panic, I'm not being wasteful or anything. So the first one is this little mini X one. And if we have a look inside, basically I want to see what you get in each box, you know, see if it's worthwhile in the future. So in this one, you can see you get the mini eggs egg. And if I, so there are some mini eggs inside of this. So I like that because that's what I remember from being little is the, the eggs being inside the egg or the sweets being inside the egg. I think that's just fun. It's like you crack open the egg and you get a surprise. So probably similar. We've got the white buttons egg as well. And I've heard that not every country has eggs as their Easter treat. So this is really interesting. I wonder if anyone can tell me, like, do you have something different? For instance, we're like a week late. We're having our Easter dinner together this weekend, that sort of thing. So anyway, I wasn't going to rabbit on. I was going to make this short and sweet. Um, so, so that's the uh, white buttons one. It's kind of cute. I don't know if it's penguins or what on there. Um, yeah, it's penguin, I think. So again, so your buttons are inside the egg. So again, really cute, nostalgic. Makes me think of loving cracking open my Easter eggs and getting a little surprise in there whatever that happens to be. Um, one. Right, so this is the Kit Kat, Kit Kat excuse me, Biscoff one. <clears throat> and just open that up and have a look what we've got inside. So it comes out on your tray there. And in the tray, excuse me, I'm getting attacked by boxes. We've got our lovely gold wrapped over the golden egg and everything. Uh, Easter egg. Words are failing me today. And there's two Kit Kat Chunkies. Um, I haven't actually had the Biscoff one. So I know I said I'm sharing, but I'm definitely going to be trying this one myself. Also, Kit Kat Chunky is, I don't know, maybe it's because I'm chunky, is one of my favourite things. So can't go wrong with Kit Kat. See, people... People underrate them, but I think they're delicious, especially the Chunkies. Although, I do have to say, while I put this away, I have seen people before eat a Kit Kat, a four-finger Kit Kat, by biting into it. Just like taking a, 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 I don't know, I think there should be a law against it. You break the fingers off. I mean, I like to nibble the chocolate from around the fingers as well, but, you know, that's, that's like, you can do that or not, but... You don't just take a bite straight into it. Anyway, got a little bit serious about that one. So next one is the caramel. And it says golden caramel chocolate. Oh, that's, I know it's going to be delicious. Uh, I don't know how much I'd be able to eat though, because I think it's quite sickly sweet, this stuff. Uh, so here we have the caramel egg. I actually quite like the way the name's printed all over that. And it's quite a nice shade as well. And then we've got a caramel bar. So again, could be delicious, I hope so. Um, and there's so many options for if you're buying eggs and you see them in the sale and you want to bake these things into cookies, that sort of thing. That'd be wonderful. And then you can share them around with everyone. And here's a Terry's chocolate orange mini eggs. I hadn't actually heard of this combo until the other day and I've got a few little things to show you but I thought wow that's pretty cool so Terry chocolate orange mini eggs now I love mini eggs you might be surprised to know there's not much chocolate I don't love so we get a packet of the Terry's chocolate orange mini eggs and of course we have to have the classic like chocolate orange wrapper color on there 
Again, I'm not sure how the colour comes out on this, the camera I'm using, um, because I thought it wasn't coming out well before when I was looking at it, and it was actually coming out perfectly fine. So, or some things were and some weren't, seemed to depend on the, the colour you were using. Anyhow, that looks amazing. I've also got, no, this is terrible. Look at this cute little bunny. Right, so I don't know what he's going to look like underneath. Um, I'm not going to unwrap because I don't want to be wasteful. Um, I kind of do want to unwrap because I want to see what's in there. But this, I'd seen all the other bunnies. I'm trying to think where I got it as well. But I'd seen all the other bunnies and I was buying everyone one each. And I did treat myself as well. Um, and they were all like three, four pounds. And this one was a pound. So... I would guess he might have been from somewhere like Aldi or Lidl. It, and it, oh, there we, I'm lying. It says Asda on the bottom. So it's from Asda. So there we go. Now, of course, it's not Easter without one of these bad boys. There we go. Cream egg. Mm -hmm. Nice. And then I found all these different little eggs, which um, me and my family have been having sort of of an evening, of a snack. We've had a couple of little eggs. I've done little bowls with them in. Quite cute. So there's the um, Terry's Chocolate Orange Mini Eggs in white. And uh, white, white chocolate, obviously. They're not in white. Excuse the noise, because if I show you them, that's what they look like. So they are orange on the outside, but they're white chocolate inside. Obviously, you've got your classic mini eggs but i don't know tell me does anyone else love them as much as i do i think my niece does don't know who else um so let's let's find oh i've got a, a maltesers bunny but it's an orange one that looks interesting looking forward to trying that okay these galaxy truffle mini eggs and they come individually wrapped. So if you're looking to do little baskets, you know, little egg hunts or something, I always think the um, the individual wrapped ones are a really good idea. Um, likewise, there's the... Sorry, try and get one out. Again, sorry about all the rattling noise. The creamy hazelnut truffle. I love Galaxy anyway. Oh my God, how much do I love it's really bad again explains the chins but again these are individually wrapped um you do tend to have green stuff for hazelnut which confuses me but i was thinking mint talking of mint how good is this after eight mini eggs and i have tried these they're so good so again little individually wrapped number i don't know what i'm doing with the focus there but a little individually wrapped ones so again they're fantastic for some of these you do get fair few in a packet if you've got even like five or six kids you're pretty much guaranteed to have like a little egg for each of them from each packet and the final ones now i was umming and ahhing because i actually remember not liking these um I, I think it's because I love peanut butter, I love chocolate, but I think it was maybe because of the, like, the candy, you know, like, American chocolate is different. So I wasn't sure if I'd like these, but these are the Reese's ones, and they were actually quite nice. I would have preferred to have Galaxy or Cadbury's chocolate or something on them. They were actually really nice. Anyway, I've done it. I've been quite quick. So I hope you enjoyed that and you've got some ideas for the future of what ones to go for. Thank you. Bye-bye.